Daisy, a tattoo that Sandra Fiscal got 17 years ago with the name of her first husband and one of her son's names is what reassures her brother Moises Fiscal that the body found by a canal in Far Saturday in fact is his beloved sister. 28 days of searching and still 41-year-old Sandra Fiscal was nowhere to be found. That is until Saturday afternoon. Her brother Moises Fiscal received a call from Far Police. He had high hopes that this painful chapter in his life had reached an end. Have you found my sister? He said, well, we got to talk to you personally. Then I asked him again, uh, is it good news or bad news? And he said, well, we have to tell you, you got to come in. I can't tell you over the phone. Right there and then. I knew something was up. In fact, things had come to an end, but it wasn't what Moises was hoping for. Investigators informed Moises they found a decomposed body by a canal near Alondra Street and Ruiz Senor Street in far Saturday morning. The body was barely identifiable, except for a tattoo with a name on the right ankle. And they asked me what name was on the tattoo, and I gave them the name of that tattoo, and sure enough, they said more than likely it is her. It was Armando, Sandra's first husband, along with her youngest son's name. For me, something criminally happened because the way the body was said and the way it was covered by debris, uh, somebody knows something. Somebody did something. The body had on the same clothes Sandra was wearing the last day Moises saw her alive and just feet from Sandra's home and where her family lives. It's inconceivable to know that it was so close and we didn't see her. It's just... Moises says the family and police walked the area numerous times searching for Sandra without luck. It was a neighbor who called police Saturday about a rotten smell coming from the field. Right now the family is mourning the death of their quote spontaneous sister who always made everybody laugh. This is where our closure comes in. Now we can start grieving. Now we can say we know where she's at. Not knowing it was just killing us. Moises tells Action 4 they expect the preliminary autopsy results on Monday and hope it will reveal if in fact this is his sister and how she died. We will keep you updated with this developing story. For now, in the studio, Valeria Ponte, Action 4 News.